Soon, 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 ciao, ciao, ciao. What's up, everybody? It's your boy, Fat and Broke. And if you haven't noticed, I got a little bit fat since we went to Thailand. For real, for real, for real. So look at that fat neck. Definitely put on a, a few LBs when we were over in uh, Thailand. Then I kind of didn't dial back the diet as I got back to Vietnam. Now you're probably guessing, well, what's his weight? What's his weight? Well, since you guys like to guess the weight, let's guess the weight in the comment section. Whoever wins however much I weigh right now, I will pin their comment. So you'll be pinned, the pinned comment for the video. So I'll let you guess. I'll give you five more seconds. Guess, let me know in the comment section. You know, while we're waiting on that, if you want to support my fat ass in additional ways, we've got a patreon.com forward slash fat and broke where I put additional content on there each week. I, dive, I go a little bit deeper in the stuff I wouldn't go deep in on YouTube. You can also access me for a private tour in Saigon when you're here. You will pay uh, a fee to me at the end of the tour. It's whatever you want. I mean, so I mean, it could be zero. If you didn't feel the tour was worth anything. And uh, the way you can do that is through Patreon. You just DM me on there. I also live stream exclusively on kick.com now. Kick.com forward slash fat bro. So while you're done guessing that, that weight and you popped it in, I weigh 113.1 kgs as of this morning. 113.1. Now when I came back, I forgot what I was at. I think it was 112.7 or 112.5 when I got back. And then I lost like three kgs. I got down to like 109. And I just went off the diet and went to shit again. Not even diet, I just went off a healthy lifestyle. And this was like, oh, the wife's like, you wanna eat Loteria fried chicken? Sure, let's eat fried chicken. So I just started making poor choices of dietary. So now we're starting to reel that back in. I'm back into, today's the second day I'm back into fasting. So right now we're on a, uh, what did I eat today? Is 6 p.m. I ate my last thing at 7.30 yesterday, so one hour and a half more and we've got a 24-hour fast. So the plan is to do a 24-hour fast and then put in a, a pretty large feeding window uh, of lean proteins and, and healthy carbs, pretty much. I don't care about keto and stuff. Probably gonna be two chicken breasts, two cups of uh, rice, and a cup of broccoli. Uh, with alternating each one of those things for different things. You know, there's ways to spice up uh, rice. You can add a little bit of butter. You can make a chicken stock. I like to make the chicken rice a lot. So you make a chicken stock for the water that you would put in when you've got the rice in the instant cooker or the rice cooker. And it gives you like a, a really nice chicken rice. And of course you can substitute cauliflower flour for broccoli and all that other good, good stuff. So there's like a hundred different ways to, to change that around. And you can change the, the chicken out for uh, salmon, you know, salmon for beef. So you can run like a patron, you know, a pantheon of different things. It's very easy to eat healthy, believe it or not. Like, it's easier to eat shittier, I swear. Like, and you have to have that shift. Like, I just haven't had that shift in my mind until like yesterday when I looked in the mirror, I'm like, man, you're fat again, dude might be good for the thumbnail. I think we got a thumbnail for every video today, but but one, which makes me happy. But yeah, I mean, I looked in the mirror, I'm like, damn dude, you're fat. And then like, I don't want it to get to a point where it's like really hard. Like if I just cut, cut the hammer now, like if you got fat again too, I know we did this a while back. Some people stayed with it. But if you got fat again too, you can uh, put the weight in, we'll follow along. I'll try to do this video every two to three weeks. So we got a TRT video coming up tomorrow for people wanting to know about TRT. So yeah, I'll, I'll go into a fast and healthy food uh, six days a week. And then one day a week, I'm just gonna eat whatever I want for a four hour window. So like, you know, do a 20 hour fast, pretty much, or a 24 even. I wanna get my 24 hour window down to 6 p.m. So eat every day exactly at 6 p.m. That seems to work really well with me. I can maintain that for years at a time. It works with time changes usually in Asia. So that works with me and it should be very, very doable. You know what I'm saying? So that's gonna be the plan. And then, yeah, like I said, one day where I eat whatever I want for like the four hour window. So if I wanna get fucking, you know, 
a pizza and a burger there you go what i've learned on that stuff now though is you can't have any leftovers like you've got to order exactly which is kind of easy to do in vietnam like i could go to a, a chain a chain restaurant like i'm not the biggest fan of domino's but like i could get a medium domino's pizza and then i could get a fried chicken there as well and like maybe a fry so like i've just gotten like a pretty decent whatever i want meal to where i don't have any extras for the next day either because if you got the extras and then if you don't have the discipline enough to like throw the shit away you'll be picking on that shit at night or tomorrow that's just this is just shit i've learned from being me each one of you guys are going to be different and like this dietary advice isn't going to work for everybody each person's body is different each person loses weight different this is a way that works really well for me and that i can maintain so i know a lot of people are going to be itching to put shit in the comment section don't worry the advice is not needed but if you want to help somebody else and, and say what works for you please be more than welcome to put that in the comment section you know what i'm saying so i mean yeah, i'm just i'm just gonna try to you know eat healthy again i got fat because i eating like shit every day i get mcdonald's late at night if i want mcdonald's late at night because i'm not drinking at home so then like another you know bizarre like i'm gonna reward myself for doing something good like a treat system which is kind of how like a lot of people that have problems with shit handle stuff like alcohol drugs food all kinds of shit so like yeah trying to do it the best possible way and i know that i can't like meal prep meal prep don't work for me my best bet is to usually uh buy the shit pre-made and there's quite a bit of like uh the meals i talk about people that sell them around here it's like a popular thing in uh in saigon is to eat like like you know like your gym gym clean eating or just like clean eating like a, a clean rice carb and, and a clean lean protein or a protein and then a vegetable for roughage so i'll probably eat a lot of steak too to be honest with you like steak there'll be a lot of steak because I, I find I can eat steak pretty consistently every day without getting tired of it. Chicken I get tired of really fast. So I have to do different cuts of chicken. I'm not a chicken whore. Like, there's levels to this shit where you take it too crazy. Like, if you're trying to get like a Liam Neeson body, not like a Lee, or like a Thor body or whatever these guys like with crazy bodies, sure, like you can go as far as to like never eating a piece of chicken skin again, only eating chicken breast boiled, like all the like no sauces on shit like all these crazy crazy rules that like some of these dudes follow but like you're not going to have a happy eating life like, you've got to also create an environment of where you're going to still have a love relationship with food you know so that's why i'm always going to have one day where i eat whatever the fuck i want the problem is you can't like you can't like have your cheat day on Sunday, right? And then Monday rolls around and you had a good workout and a good day and you're like, well, let me do my cheat day Monday. So then you just did two, like that shit don't fly. I, if you know what I'm talking about, you know what I'm talking about. Like, you know what I'm talking about. So that's where I'm at. I'm gonna do my best. I'll keep you guys updated. I'm aware I'm fat. I look fat on camera. I look fat on live streams. I have gained weight. You're all right. I'm a fat, 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 and broke. Some the bitch. As ever, I thank you guys for watching. Go check me out on Patreon. Check me out live streaming on kick.com. We'll see you on the next one. Stay frosty. Peace out.